Welcome to FootballGamePlan.com, where football makes sense. That's Emory Hunt is Art of Playbook, and I'm Tyler Merkovich bringing you a quarterfinal preview of an FCS matchup. William and Mary 10 and 2 against the 11 and 1 Salukis of Southern Illinois, who defeated Eastern Illinois 48 to 7. William and Mary beat up on Weber State 38 nothing. They won the turnover margin five by five. And they're 6 of 15 on third down. They won the time of possession. Four interceptions. This defense will get after you, the tribe. What are your keys to victory for them? I look at the matchup of defensive end Adrian Tracy versus the Saluki's offensive line. If they're able to block the tremendous talent that he has, he can get after the quarterback, double digit sacks this season, they're going to have some success on, on offense. But they really have to block Adrian Tracy because he is a tremendous talent, big playmaker. Also, William Mary, they have to score touchdowns in the red zone. 50% touchdown percentage in the red zone. They can't have that this week against a tremendous team like Southern Illinois. So they have to make sure once they get into the red zone, it's going to be a close game. It's going to be a slow-paced game because that's the type of defense William Mary has. So they have to make sure on their end, offensively, when they get in the red zone, they have to score touchdowns. And Deji Karim. The great running back for the Saluki. He's 23 carries for 155 yards. He's been doing it all year. They also dominated in time of possession here. 390 total yards, five fumble recoveries, and a touchdown. Both these teams benefited big time from big turnover margins. What are your keys to victory for SIU? Well, you look at McIntosh, the freshman. He's going to have to make some plays down the field. He's going to be forced to make some plays down the field because William & Mary can't stop the run. So Kareem may not have a big day. But he's going to have an efficient day, but they're going to force McIntosh to make some plays down the field passing, too. You look at Southern Illinois, they're going to have to run off tackle. When you have a tremendous pass rusher, the best way to stop him is to run right at him. So they're going to have to run right at Tracy to take him out the game, make him be a run defender instead of teeing off on, on McIntosh. But I do like... William Mary on the road because I think that defense, mm -hmm. anytime you play a good offense, you take you always want to side with the defense. Even though I like Karim, I like McIntosh. He has a bright future for Southern Illinois. But I think defensively, I, I think William Mary can do it. I can see I like the tribe up. because they're going to win the turnover battle. They're not going to give up the ball as easy as Eastern Illinois did to Southern Illinois. So they're going to take care of the ball and they got a better defense, I think. If they stop Karim, so Illinois doesn't have too many other options with McIntosh tossing the ball. So I'm taking the Tribe. Colonial Athletic Association has been superb this season. For more, visit footballgameplan.com slash smallcolleges.